Yo, what is up, fam? Uh, so, I bet you thought we were done with Shovel Knight, but in fact, we were not. So today we're gonna be taking on Shovel Knight, Plague of Shadows. Uh, and this one you play as Plague Knight, Unavoidable, Plague of Shadows. So, I don't know what we're gonna name ourselves this time. What should we name ourselves? Oh, right, you can't talk to me. <laughs> Losers? How about... Uh... Uh... Plo... Floor stew. Floor stew. That's good. So, Plague of Shadows is infinitely harder than the original, and I don't remember how to play it. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventure. But villainy ran rampant, and in time, even the most stalwart heroes fell. In the absence of champions, the Enchantress and her Order of No Quarter swept into power. Unbeknownst to everyone, the maniacal alchemist Plague Knight had plans of his own. He sought nothing less than to concoct a potion of unlimited power. A draft so fiendishly potent that nothing he desired would be out of his reach. Each night unknowingly guards a crucial ingredient. Now the collection must begin. So in this game, there's a, a thing you can collect, like a currency called play, uh, plague coins. No, cipher coins, and they're really hard to find. So I'm not going to be collecting all of them. Uh oh, the boss is in his way. We've got to get back to the lab fast. I don't want to get experimented on. Just hold Y to charge and bomb burst out of here. Come on, hurry up. Wow, they play the same way that Plague Knight does. That's crazy. Why can't I play as them? Bribe your potion. Wow, look, it's me. Okay, so... <laughs> he does the same duck that Shovel Knight does. Okay, so I can double jump. And I can do that. Wait. Uh, okay, so this is a lot more different. A lot different for... That's not fair. Uh, very much not the same. Oh crap. As um, Shovel of Hope. Because obviously I'm a character who's a lot more floaty. No, he, he's actually about the same floaty one. But, um, but, you know, he controls differently, he's got different abilities. And uh, right now I just have, like, the default bombs, which is essentially what I'm gonna stick with for most of this. But. Uh, the weapon system in this, in this game, instead of being, um, like, magic items, I think there might still be magic items, but, um, it's, it's like potion making, like all this, oh, arcana is the, like, the magic tool, you get, like, casting, or, uh, powder, and it, it's just, like, uh, the arc that you're, um, so it's essentially just like the arc that your bombs go in, and the, um, the explosion type that it makes, and how short the fuse is. So that's what that does. Health tonic, a, bag, a full bag of tonic to upgrade your max health. Just open the menu with minus and drink them down. Cool. How do I... What button do I press? Oh, I have to be in the menu. Gotcha. It's been a while. This is the one I played the least. Uh, I played Shovel Knight, uh, Shovel of Hope the most, and then I think I played Spectre of Torment like twice. So still not very much, but more than this. Because the first time I played this, it took me a really long time to actually beat. Because I did not fully understand it, and I didn't know what the best bomb combination was going to be, so uh, I usually ended up just going with essentially just this, but um, 
It's, I used one that does a huge, really big explosion, um, but you can only use it like once when there's a bomb out. Like when this, I can throw like three, but you can only throw one. And I used like the non-existent uh, fuse, so it explodes on contact. But uh, yeah, pretty, pretty cool. Means I'm a master potion man. Also on my Instagram, there was a little pixel art that I did of pixel, of pixel night, of Plague Night uh, on graph paper. If any of you follow me on Instagram, which you should, by the way, then you probably know that. Also, if you haven't noticed, this is essentially just Shovel Knight, like, the entire game. Uh, same levels, uh, but as Plague Knight. I think there are some changes in the levels, and I think some of the boss fights might be like a little bit different. But um, the, the Spectre Knight one is completely different. I just think I think there might be a few fewer levels, and that's why the King Knight campaign is going to be so exciting because there are like 80 billion levels. Like there are more levels in the King Knight. I, I'm pretty sure what they said was there are more levels in the King Knight campaign than there were in the original Shovel Knight campaign. Which is nuts. I love it. So yeah, we're gonna play this. And then... Um, on Salt and Salt here, which should be starting up soon, because um, my dad is gonna teach me some editing soon. Uh, it was gonna be the day, but I decided to record with him instead, because we don't get the chance to that often. Um, but Kim and I, uh, of Salt and Salt here, are going to uh, probably do... Because I'm, I'm playing the Shovel Knight games to lead up to King of Cards when that comes out in April. So uh, Kim and I are probably going to play... Well, I'm going to play King of Cards on this channel, but we're probably going to play Shovel Knight Showdown uh, on, on the day it comes out. Because that comes out like on the same day as King of Cards does. If you don't know what Shovel Knight Showdown is, then I don't blame you because it is probably the least hype thing about what's going to happen that day. Because like the Amiibos come that day, which I did pre-order, so those are going to come that day. It's going to be a big exciting day. Uh, and then like the Amiibos. <gasps> cool. Have I mentioned I'm not good at this one? Oh, poor stew. Um, yeah, but Shovel Knight Showdown is essentially like a fighting game with Shovel Knight characters that they're doing for free, I think. Oh, crap. Oh, no, I'm wasting all my money that I don't even have. I've got like 1,000 gold, and that's it. This part is obnoxiously hard for being in the first level. Oh, shoot. Welp, this is going well. I am the master of this game. If you could, oh my god! Are you kidding me? But there are like, I think... You can play, in Showdown you can play as like, every night, and then... Um, I think there are some extras, like you might be able to play as... Like, I know you can play as Shield Knight and Black Knight, but you might be able to play as, like, the Enchantress or something? I don't know. I know you can play as one of the Gold Armors, which are the Yellow Knight dudes with the shields that are annoying to kill. Oh my god, they did it. Holy crap. That was difficult. <laughs> nice. Oh, that's a secret. Okay. So you're about to see... Oh, no, that's not a secret. That's just how we get to the next area. But, um, that's a new thing in this campaign, are the cauldrons, which are essentially, like, if you don't have a way of getting to a really high up place, then the cauldrons just, like, shoot you up there. So it's exciting. Yeah. I will demonstrate right now, after killing this tiny defenseless dragon thing. Die. Yeah. So you just get on in there and it's all like pew, and that is cool. Ouch. I never noticed how painful that looks before. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, so Showdown should be fun. We'll play that on Salt and Salt here, because it's, you know, like a, a multiplayer thing. Um, it's essentially Smash Bros, but, like, you're competing for the amount of gold you have, so it's like Coin Smash. But, um, and it's really neat. It looks a, like a lot of fun. I haven't watched any gameplay of it other than the initial trailer. Well, I don't know if there even is any more gameplay of it other than the initial trailer. Um, because I want it to be kind of fresh. Also, uh, while making King of Cards, um, Yacht Club would do Twitch streams, where they would, like, stream them making pixel art or whatever. And I saw one of the streams, and I was like, nope, I'm not watching any more of these. That's spoilery. Because Shovel Knight is cool, and I want it to be not spoiled. Because that would be bad. Oh boy, okay. This is a fine pickle that we're in right here. <laughs> mm, there we go. There it is. Nice. You just gotta rely on the, the boomies, you know? <laughs> oh, this is easy. Easy. Nice. Alright, cool. And you just gotta boop. Easy sauce. Dude, this is like... Dang. Wow. Give me some challenge, you know? Like, come on. I know it's the first level, but jeez. Ouch. Um... Although... I don't remember... Who the boss is in Plague Knight's area. So that's gonna be interesting to try and remember. It's me, Plague Knight! That's his voice, by the way, if you missed my initial playthrough. I don't know. Oh, I saved myself, because I'm super cool. Take that. I really like that he just throws bombs, because Shovel Knight just sort of attacked with a shovel, and it wasn't anything too extraordinary. But, like, he throws explosives, and it's weird and different. You know? Good, different things are good. Most of the time. Uh, and then the Spectre Knight one just plays like they were trying to make their own version of Ninja Gaiden. And honestly, if they made Ninja Gaiden, it would be pretty good. Listen to me, Magicist. I know you're aiding him in his quest for the ultimate po potion. Ultimate what? I haven't seen him since he fled to join the Order of No Quarter. Ah, uh, alchemical trickery. You can't fool me. I know he plans to use the potion to beguile you. Wait, me? What are you insinuating? Oh, someone's coming! Oh, it's the panicky pushover. Is winning the Magicist heart worth betraying your allies? Hehehe, <laughs> what? Where in the world did you hear that? And I know how you plan to gather ingredients. The only thing worse than a deranged alchemist is a traitor. Do what you will with the Order, but none threaten the Enchantress and live. He don't want me to kill his girl. He's also real easy to beat in this one. Because I can just do... Ow. It's, uh... Mm, there we go. Okay, so this, I don't think, is the one where the bosses are changed at all. I think they're just exactly the same. But, um... In Spectre of Torment... I I'm more excited to play Spectre of Torment on here than I am to play this. Because that one, it, it's essentially a brand new game. And this is just Double Knight, but you play as Blake Knight. But whatever. It's not bad by any means. The story's still good. Oh yeah, look at me doing a cute little dance. I'm so cool. Dang, look how cool I am. So cool. I don't get to rest at a campfire because I'm not cool like Shovel Knight. That's right. I'm lame. Alt, no weapons allowed. Wait a minute. Let's just pretend I don't recognize you and you go safely on your merry way. This doesn't have to get messy. And don't show your creepy bird face around here again, freak. Alt, maybe you didn't hear me through that mask. Oh yeah. We already had this conversation, pal. You're not supposed to be here. Now get lost before I lose my patience. 
So this is one of the new areas in the game. Um, Psst, hey Plague Knight, I'm still guarding your secret entrance, but I lost the key. The locksmith should be here in a week or two. Maybe you could wait until then? Or I can jump over and then do a... This. Got him. Now what does he have to say for himself? Well, I guess I'm canceling the locksmith appointment. <sighs> this was the house I grew up in. Well, then maybe you shouldn't have had uh, Plague Knight build a uh, secret base in the uh, bottom of it. What do you have to say to that, dude? Now, this should be familiar. Hehe, <laughs> Mona! We have a big, uh, problem on our hands. We've been found out. Oh, the Black Knight thing. Yeah, Magisus filled me in. Don't worry, a beak. That fool has nothing on us. Look, all we need to worry about is those final ingredients. We're stuck languishing here in obscurity until then. Yes, he <laughs> The essences. I shall pay our friends a little visit and uh, <laughs> borrow them. Right, and while you're doing that, I'll keep researching ways to get more bang for our buck. You know what they say. The bigger the explosion, the better the alchemist. Yes, he <laughs> Let's get to work. Oh, snap. Oh, spinny things. Spinny things be spinny, dog. Whoa! <laughs> These lifts never cease to both amuse and nauseate. Oh. Truly a dizzying display of technology. <laughs> anyway, welcome back to the Potionarium. So, what are we working on? Can I buy anything? Oh, I can. Bob casting. Long. None of these are good. Uh, um, I'll buy this. No. This one. I'll buy this. One. Thanks, Mona. Mona's cool. Wait, can I research yet? Okay, one hundred and forty. No. Okay, cool. Neat. <laughs> uh, nice. Picked up your special delivery. Want to take a look and settle the bill? Yeah. Oh, okay, I can buy that. That's how you go fishing in this game, essentially. Bait bomb. What's up, my just says. Ah, uh, hello, Plague Knight. Well, the Black Knight tried to interrogate me, but I think I threw him off the trail. Whether it's business or personal, don't worry. Your secrets are safe with me, Plague Knight. Anyway, yes, of course. Uh, you'd like potions, would you? Uh, magic upgrade. Man, I have to use money for magic upgrades and... Oh, but magic works differently in this one. Uh, Plague Knight, my good friend, a moment of your time. <sighs> How can I help you, Percy? I've run out of paper and I can't get any more ballistic formulae on my hoof. I'm in desperate need. <sighs> Do you need glue as well? I know how we can make some. <laughs> oh, why, thank you, but just the paper will do. Oh, and by the way, you're looking a bit forlorn uh, lately. Maybe I'll repay your kindness with some love advice. My ally, there's four sheets of paper you brought me. Five hundred gold for each. Oh, what is this folly? There's some sort of musical notation scribbled all over it. On both sides. There's nowhere for me to write. Useless. Into the trash bin it goes. Phew. Was he talking? I must have blanked out. Oh, Tim. Ah. Everyone works so hard down here. Yes, and who knows what to help? Can help make music. But got tired, fell asleep, went awake, forgot almost all music. So sad. Poor Oolong. Will think very hard. Maybe remember more music. Then I help. I help science. Well, you can do that some other time. The, the, thanks for watching. I uh, hope you enjoy the fact that we're not playing any game other than Plague Knight. Uh, I mean, Shovel Knight, forever and ever. Uh, goodbye, everybody. Subscribe.